Okay, think about this aspect of it specifically. You're afraid right now. So at a certain point in your upbringing, in your Christian indoctrination, in your youth or something, those ideas were implanted in you. And think about if an idea has to enforce compliance through fear, what does that say about the idea, the value of the idea? Not just the truth value of it, but the moral value of it. You know, if you have to be terrorized into accepting a belief and then adhering to a belief above all else, that should say something, and you should really, really consider the value of the belief at that point. The real problem that I have with Christianity generally is that it is, when you cut it right to the quick, it is a carrot and stick religion, right? Heaven is the carrot that they dangle in front of you, and hell is the stick that they beat your ass with to make sure that you're constantly chasing that carrot. You know? And that's not, I don't think, either a moral or an intellectual way, I think, to, to build up a person so that they are, uh, you know, a happy, rational individual as an adult.